What's up, YouTube? Alright, it's time I start filming my Q&A video. And yeah, these are my favorite videos to do. And I've been on break for a while because I've been tired and I've been taking taking some rest. The other day, I didn't get any sleep for over a day. I didn't get any sleep for 32 hours and then I got like... About 16 hours of sleep. Alright. Here are my questions for my video. <coughs> First question comes from... Oh. This was withheld? Uh, now you'll get a shout out to Nick Hewitt. Um, he's a really great guy. I watched his video on Copper Cab and Copper Cab Mom and Dad. Copper Mom and Dad actually. And it was really funny. <laughs> Made me laugh. Nick Hewitt is a great YouTuber. And his question is, what are your view on haters? They're just stupid. They just waste their time. But it's funny. Because they don't have enough balls to come up to me and personally say that to my face. To like say, oh you're an ugly wigger faggot. Which this guy called Ugly Coon wrote. Oh you're um, you're God of the gays. Which Jay Silence does not have big enough balls to come and say that to my face. Um, next up on Ass Clown, your bleached hair is so gay you lack talent in front of a camera. He doesn't even have any balls to buy a plane ticket and come up to me and say that to my face. Least Light Critic 75, he is a great YouTuber. His views on videos are really good, and I really enjoy watching his videos. So you should subscribe to all the people that I'm going to mention. <laughs> Do you have a favorite sci-fi show? Not really. I don't watch too many TV shows. The only TV shows I watch are like Family Guy, The Simpsons. About it. But if I could put a movie in there, it would be Family... Um, um, I'm a Star Wars. That's the only sci-fi stuff I watch. I'm not too much of a fan of... Uh, Star Trek, but I do like Patrick Stewart. He's hilarious. Do you have a favorite crime-solving show? Um, out of all the shows that deal with crime-solving, I'd have to say... Honestly, I think I would have to say Law & Order. Scooby-Doo 9608. Um, <coughs> this guy is a really great YouTuber. I became a fan of his after I saw a comment on his, I saw Eric Beerthal in 92's comment on his video, so I watched it, hold up, hold up. There we go. Um, Alright, Scooby-Doo9608. He's a great YouTuber. We talk on Facebook occasionally. And sometimes we... Uh, yeah, I'll go and watch his videos a lot because his videos are really entertaining. And I really like his videos. And we've known each other since like... I think it must have been June. What movies made you cry? Um, Land Before Time when Lil Foot's mom died. The first two are really sad. McDonald's or Burger King? Mmm, honestly, I like them both. If I have to go for chicken tenders, like, you know, those little chicken nuggets, I would... I would have to say... McDonald or Burger King, but if I'm going for fries, I would have to say Burger King. But if I'm going for like a, wa a like a burger, I would honestly have to say McDonald's because I love their Big Macs and their double quarter pounders. But honestly, I can't choose. I love them both. But my favorite overall fast food restaurant is Taco Bell and Subway. Subway is definitely probably my favorite. Then Taco Bell, then KFC. I like KFC's chicken the best though. Which one of my videos did you like the most? Ooh. You know... 
I like your pissed off video about ass clown and I like your shout out video where you gave me a shout out and I like your video where you uh, your Q&A video I really enjoyed and I can't wait till you film another one what did you think about ass clown so legendary being removed from YouTube if he is I think that's a good thing because because that kid's just a just a ignorant moron. He just tries to smash your bash your reviews. And and disliked and all he does is makes fun of you and then thumbs down your videos. He thumbs down all my videos. He thumbs down a few he commented on. What do you think about the Evil Dead remake? You know, I can't say anything because I haven't watched it, but... No. Nah. Favorite horror movie? Favorite horror movie? Um... Scream. The 1996 version. Favorite kids movie? I like The Land Before Time. I like... I like The Lion King, Sleeping Beauty, Beauty and the Beast, um, I'm definitely a big fan of, I'm a big Lamb Before Time fan, that's probably my favorite kid movies, my favorite movies as kids too, but, uh, favorite movie as a kid, I also like, um, a lot of other movies though, but, um, yeah, I, I don't have, like, a humongous DVD collection, but holy shit, I love to watch movies. That's about all I can say, I mean. Yeah, Land Before Time and a lot of Disney movies, a lot of kid Disney movies. And when I was a kid, I would love Pirates of the Caribbean. Um... <sighs> All-time favorite movie. Um. 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 Uh. The Karate Kid. The Karate Kid Part 2. I'll list like top five maybe. Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2. The Hobbit and Unexpected Journey. Which I hope to review sometime. But my fifth I have a list. Because I I have a lot of movies that I really love. Come on. Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I'll give a top six. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Crocodile Dundee. Crocodile Dundee 2. Then Back to the Future. They're all great movies. And then, right here, I'd have to say Pepsi or Coca-Cola. Um, I can't choose. I love them both. Do you think I have talent? Hell yeah, man. I've seen your videos of what pisses you off. Your Q&A video. Your movie reviews. Hell yeah, man. You got talent. Who inspired you to make YouTube videos? Well, honestly, I think you've asked that a couple of times, but I'll answer it any time you ask it from now on. Eric Virthaler 92 was probably my main inspiration. Um, you inspired me a little bit. Um, Nate Dunning inspired me. What pissed me off? V, V10, I think it is. John Ferreira, yeah. Number five, I'd have to say. There were other major YouTube YouTubers, but... um. I'd have to say those are my top four inspirations. What sort of video games do you like from Matthew Fisher? And Matthew Fisher is a great friend of mine. He went to the high school with my girlfriends. And I've, I was watching one of his videos earlier today, and it's a really beautiful video. Give me a minute. Can't find the game I like. And I had it up on my shelf. Well, I'll 
I'll tell you what kind of video games I like to play. My favorite is Legaia 2 Dual Saga for the PlayStation 2, and I also like Duke Nukem for the Nintendo 64. And next up after those videos, uh, next up after those games, I like James Bond Nightfire. Alright. R3DM3G. <sighs> this person's really nice. And, um, it was really nice of her or him. Um, I think it's a her. I think. I don't know. Could be a him or her. But it's a really nice person, um, and I hope that, uh, to see more videos if this person posts more. What are you most proud of? I'm proud of graduating high school, and I'm proud that, that I have gotten more support after I've been making more videos. Yeah, more people have come on to here and been supporters of mine, and of course I always get... I always get bashed sometimes, but, um, who cares? All I've been mostly called on here is fat. Really, that doesn't affect me as much as it used to, because I'm really not that fat. Why do you want to get married? Because I'm in love with my, with the love of my life. Where do you hide your porno stash? I don't watch porno. Jordan is silly. Now this guy is fucking hilarious. This guy is awesome. He he gave me a shout out a long time ago on my um, on a video because I showed him a video called Rant on Mayland. He then one talks about Steve Wilkos and he really liked that video and he said I'm a cool guy and I make these make good videos and I really wanted to say thank you to Jordan because he is a really really great guy and um, if you haven't subscribed to this guy you should go subscribe to him I'll post all the links into the description to these people's channels D and Jordan's question is could Mayland Heathen 1 be an actor playing a drunken fuck I guess he could or he could just be a drunk I mean, I mean, I don't see b drinking as being cool. Yeah. I mean, I've only drank in once in my life, and that was on my 21st birthday. And I don't drink. I don't drink that often. Maybe I'll have a sip. That's it. At parties, I might have a little bit more, but not as much as I u usually like to. I don't like to drink that much. Okay, Eric Dugan. Do you like Metallica? Oh, Eric Dugan. He's just an old friend of mine from... He he moved to Florida, and then he's going to move to Newark, New Jersey after he's done with college for a year. Then he's going to move back down to Florida, and then he's going to move to Europe. Do you like Metallica? Metallica is okay. Metallica... Or ACDC. Honestly, I'd have to say ACDC. Kiss or Metallica? Um, Kiss. Did you like the movie Ted? Yeah, I did. I thought it was pretty funny. And my favorite part was when they were making fun of Superman. The old Superman. Or the new Superman with Brandon Routh. Brandon Routh is, is not that good to me. Favorite big YouTubers. Well, my favorite big YouTubers, I mean major YouTubers who get a lot of subscribers, not saying that my inspirations don't come from, don't get good subscribers, because Scooby-Doo 9608's there, uh, Eric Vierthal is there, and so is, and so is, um, my other friends, will piss me off, V10. Um, 
Annoying Orange, AVGN, Nostalgia Critic, Blood Blitz. Blood Blitz was one of my main inspirations at first. Are are you a big Harry Potter fan? Yeah, I am. I am a big Harry Potter fan. You Lord of the Rings or a Hobbit fan? Well, I like the Hobbit movie better than Lord of the Rings. For reasons I'll keep... Th if you have to ask why, I'd just say I like the journeys better. Aragon fan? Big Aragon fan. Hate, hated the movie. Accidentally sk skipped a question. Forgive me, Eric Verthaler 92 What is your opinion on the Boston bombing? I think this country's going way too out of hand. It's fucked up. I wanted to move to Boston for one point, but maybe I'll just go to Oregon someday. Maybe. Maybe Oregon, maybe Europe, somewhere there. I don't know. Are you excited for the Man of Steel? Steel. Whoops. Yes, I am. I am very excited for the Man of Steel. And Eric Virthon 92 shout out. I've been a friend of this guy since 2000. I've been a friend of Eric since 2010. So it's almost been three years now. I used to make fun of him in 2009, but then I quit and said, just think what you want. I give up making fun of you. And then... We added, we talked on MySpace, and then we started talking on Facebook, and then at one point we started talking on my yearbook, but I think he deleted that. And Eric Virthar92 asked me a long time ago, do I see talent in him? And for that, for that answer, hell yeah, man! I've seen, I, I, I love your pissed off and your overrated and videos. Those, those videos are freaking epic, and. And yeah, for that, I do see talent in you, big time. Um, those are the questions here. My friend Curtis, 13 Urch. If you can subscribe to this guy, please subscribe to him. He's hilarious. Q&A video. What's the best form or technique of beating eggs? Either use a kitchen beater or, or a mixing bowl to mix your egg yolks or eggs. And I'm not too good at dropping eggs into a bowl, so I would do it by shell, but now I just do it by hand because the egg white drops quicker. Jason Rains. I heard about this guy from what from Scooby Doo nine six oh eight and he's a really great person to talk. He's really polite and he's really nice. I subscribed to him and he subscribed back. And he asked, okay, you like W.E.E., -E, who's your favorite superstar? What is your favorite type of gun? What's your favorite show? My favorite show, if you're talking about TV, is... If I had to choose, what would I say? Hmm. That's a good question. That is a really, really good question. Family Guy, Simpsons, Law and Order. About that. I don't really watch TV, but I, I have this thing um, up on. I use my computer to watch TV shows now, or just use my, or just go buy the Simpsons or Family Guy season online or at Walmart. You like W E E? Not a big fan. If if Scooby Doo nine six zero eight, aka Brandon Johnson, started doing it, I would definitely watch it. Who's your favorite superstar? I don't know what you mean, dude. Favorite type of gun? Um, I don't really know a lot about guns. I'm not a really violent person, but if I definitely go hunting, I'll take up a shotgun or a rifle, maybe. Do you like, uh, Lan I can't pronounce this, Lanto Hariel, that's as good as I can pronounce, I'm not good at pronouncing names, I know Brandon Johnson has given them, um, shout outs before, um, do you like school, do you play sports, are you a horror movie fanatic? And what's your favorite scary movie? And by the way, 
Lantern Hartnell is a very nice person. I'll link every description so you can subscribe to their channel. Um, do you like school? Uh, not really. High school sucked. I mean, I liked hanging out with friends at lunchtime. That was my favorite. Do you play sports? Not really. I was a baseball and football manager, though, but I won a trophy for being the baseball manager. Uh, and if you didn't see me hold up that trophy, go back into some of my previous videos where I showed it. Um, do you... Are you a horror movie fanatic? Not really. I mean, I like a few scary movies. No, And I think Brandon asked what movie scared me the most, or some people have asked that. Stephen King's It. Because Scream wasn't that scary, but that's my favorite. What is your favorite scary movies? Scream. <laughs> Here we go. David Donnelly. DJ Donnelly from... He's a friend of mine on Facebook and on YouTube. Okay, here's a lot of questions from him. I got about a hundred. Who would win out of these horror I icons? Jason Voorhees, Michael Myers, or Freddy Cougar? Probably Michael Myers, even though I don't watch any of those guys. Forgive me. If you had a time machine from Back to the Future... Would you go back into the past or into the future? Yes, I would go back in the past to stop me from making mistakes that I used to. And I'm not going to talk about what I made a mistake in because it's way too personal. No offense. Um, I would definitely like to go back into the past to watch my favorite movies as kids. Like The Karate Kid, Back to the Future on the big screen. Batman on the big screen. Superman on the big screen. That would be awesome. And kids would be like... What kind of clothes are those? Because I wear today's clothes. Yeah. So I'd just be walking around being who I am. And watching my favorite bands perform. If you had a magic ticket from the last action hero and the magic ticket could transform into any movie just like Danny from the last action hero, which movies would you like it to be in and why? You know, that's a good question, but I don't understand. I've never seen The Last Action Hero, but I've seen a few minutes of it, but that's when I was a kid. My mom didn't want me to watch it because she said it was too violent. That's when I was a kid. Um, any movie. Probably some of my favorite movies, if I could, you know. But most of them, The Hobbit. Yeah. And judging to that last question, or one of those questions that Eric asked me, um, Q&A video, um, am I a fan of Lord of the Rings? I am an okay fan. I don't watch... I wasn't allowed to watch them, but I would always sneak watch them when my parents were never around, when my mom and brother were never around, actually. The only people who live here are me, my mom, and my brother. Um, what was the first TV show you ever saw as a kid? You know, I never really watched TV kit, TV shows. When I started watching The Simpsons, I was 16 years old. So I've been watching The Simpsons for almost five years now. And I was watching The Simpsons just sitting in my back room. And by the way, David Donnelly is a really nice person. He's really respectful, and I like his videos, too. In your opinion, who played the best Batman and Bruce Wayne? Adam West, Michael Keaton, Val Kilmer, George Clooney, or Christian Bale? I like Christian Bale most of all. Michael Keaton was pretty good. Adam West was not the worst. Val Kilmer wasn't too bad. I like George Clooney. I thought he was a good choice for Batman. So I'd have to say Christian Bale. I like them all, though, but what's your favorite movie soundtrack and why? I can't pick. I'll be back. Sorry for the inconvenience.
Sorry for the inconvenience. Um, maybe, maybe The Hobbit, because I like some of The Hobbit's music. Would you ever do a video on your 69 horror, horror movie fans of all time? Well, if I could only list horror movie... I, I, I've only watched, like, five, like... Scream, Scream 2, Scream 3. Oh, I've only watched like four. The first three Screams and Mothman and Prophecies, actually. That movie was wasn't too horror, but it was scary. It scared the shit out of me. And the fifth movie, I'd have to say, was It with the killer clown. What are your top ten favorite Arnold movies of all time? If you mention Arnold Schwarzenegger, I've only seen like three movies of him. Last Action Hero, a little bit, sort of. Um, Jingle All the Way and Batman and Robin. And Batman, Batman and Robin was dog shit. What are your thoughts on today's horror movies? Are they getting good reviews or worse? Can they less jump? Well, I haven't seen less jump scares in the movies, or should they bring back the normal? Should they bring back like practical effects, CGI effects? Well, I can't answer that question, dude, because I don't watch horror movies right now um, as much as I, like, I'm a big Scream fan, though. Have you ever walked out of a cinema and asked for your money back because the movie you saw pissed you off? No, not like Eric Verthon, but, but I wasn't too into the pursuit of happiness. I don't know why, though. Do you believe in the paranormal, such as ghosts? No, I don't believe in ghosts. What are your top ten favorite childhood movies of all time? Oh, that's a hard one. My favorite childhood movie is Land Before Time 4, Journey Through the Mists, which I just watched the other day because I hadn't seen that movie in forever, and it reminds me of being a kid. I definitely like The Lion King. Toy Story. I like... Man, I like a lot of... Man, childhood movies. I like Aladdin. And I like Aladdin 3. I like... I like a lot of movies. So I can't answer all of them because... There's too many, but Land Before Time, Journey Through the Mists is definitely my favorite. And yeah, Lion King, answering your earlier question, made me shed a few tears too. But I'm not ashamed to admit it. Who inspired you to make YouTube videos? That's a repeat question. But yeah, mostly the Land Before Times were my favorite childhood movies and some of those Disney movies I mentioned. What is your favorite fast food place to go and why? Subway because it's because it's because it's healthier for you. Taco Bell because I love burritos and Mexican food is my favorite type of food even though it's kind of, you know, would you rather watch movies online or go to the cinema and buy or buy them on Blu-ray or Laserdisc? I've never had Laserdisc. I don't even know what the hell that is. Sometimes I buy them on Blu-ray or DVD, or sometimes I'll even go to the cinema to go watch them on the big screen. I love them. What was the first movie you ever bought on VHS? Uh, to, uh, honestly, I don't really freaking remember. I mean, I got a whole box of VHS and DVDs in my closet in a box. Are you a fan of zombie movies? No, I want to watch Zombieland, though, because I'm a big Woody Harrelson fan. Are you a fan of the band Queen? Not really. I've heard a few of their movies or their songs. What was that song? What was... Their song called um, Bicycle Race. Are you a fan of Rob Zombie? No. Are you 
I don't even know who that is, actually. And I heard his music is great, but I heard his movies suck. Are you a big fan? Are you a fan of Ozzy? Ozzy Osbourne. I've heard Crazy Train, but I'm not too much of a fan. Do you watch sports? No, occasionally I'll watch baseball. Baseball is my favorite sport, but then occasionally I will watch that other team that uh, I will occasionally watch football sometimes. If you won the lotto, what would you first buy and why? I would probably go get lipo suction to get the fat stuck down my stomach so I could probably run a little bit quicker, but then you have to exercise every day. I could do that. Have you ever... Have you ever fallen asleep while watching a movie? If so, what was it called? And if you can remember. Yeah, I remember falling asleep a couple of years ago um, over at my brother's best friend's house. But he moved right now. We were watching um, Rush Hour, the first one. And then I stayed over at my sister's house for, for a little bit. And this was the first time I ever fell asleep in the movie That's My Boy. It's because I didn't get any sleep the night before, so then she woke me up, and then I went to bed, and then I woke up, and I had a lot of sleep. I don't like sleeping so much. I slept for about 16 hours, and I wasn't too proud. I wanted to sleep for a few hours. Do you like Jim Carrey as an actor? What are your top 10 favorite Jim Carrey movies? Well, I haven't seen a lot with him, but yeah, I am a Jim Carrey fan. I like Fun with Dick and Jane, The Mask. I've seen him in Batman Forever. I didn't too much hate that movie, even though it wasn't that great. Um, what was that other movie's name? Oh, now you should know this one. The Grinch with Jim Carrey. That was a great one. Those are, like, the ones I know the most. What is worse, Spider-Man Trilogy or Nolan's Batman Trilogy? What's more worse? Well, I'm more of a fan of Batman than Spider-Man, so I'd have to go with Nolan's trilogy as better, but I don't know too much about Spider-Man, but I prefer Batman. What are your thoughts on young people's today's generation? I think it sucks, because you got the Jonas Brothers, you got Justin Bieber. People are like, I love the Jonas Brothers. Okay, better than the Jonas Brothers, ACDC. Kiss. And you want to know a joke that Eric Verthaler told me? What's the difference between a Snickers bar and Justin Bieber? A Snickers bar actually has nuts. Yeah, a Snickers bar actually does have nuts. And I asked, and I told people that at high school, and a lot of people got a good laugh out of it. And then at the end, they said, at the end, some people were mad at me, and a lot of and over at a football game, I asked, what's the difference between a Snickers bar and Justin Bieber? And one said, one actually has nuts. And I said, yeah, a Snickers bar actually has nuts. And some people said, actually, one tastes good. <laughs> and I started laughing. Are you looking forward to the movie that are coming out this year in the upcoming months? Yeah, I am. I'm looking forward to The Hobbit. I want to watch Grown Ups 2, even though Grown Ups wasn't that wasn't that good, but they're chucking Rob Schneider out of Grown Ups too. They he's not in. Um, I'm looking forward to the Hunger Games too, so I'll definitely look forward to a few more of the Fast and Furious Six or something. Have you ever cried while watching a movie? What was it called? That's a repeat question. Like Lion King and some of the Land Before Time movies, you know. What is your favorite ACDC song and why? I'd have to say for those about to rock, we salute you because that was the song that really started my loving of ACDC. Uh, what is your favorite ice cream flavor? Oh, that's a hard one. That's too hard. Um, I make ice cream anyway. I like caramel but that's not my favorite. I like chocolate. So I like a few. I like strawberry. What are your thoughts on the movie generation today? Is it better or worse or the old generation that you grew up in in your childhood? Well, I like The Hobbit. And I like the Harry Potter ones. That's what I grew up with, too. 
What are your thoughts on the music generation today? Is it better or worse than the old school music generation? The oldies are way better. What are your favorite quotes of all time and why? Wax on, wax off, Mr. Miyagi. Why? Because it's a classic quote. That was my... That was my, um... Wax on right hand, wax off left hand was my was my um, senior quote. Do you go to church? No, but I'm a Christian. Have you ever thought about making a band or movie of your own someday? Yeah, I'm writing a story and I wanted to be a and I want to turn it into a movie. And then I wanted to um, be a rock and roll band lead singer one day. Have you ever thought about making? In your opinion, what is worse? What is worse, Batman? Out of them, seen them in all. Out of them all. Uh, Batman and Robin all the way. Batman and Robin sucked balls. In your opinion, what is the worst nightmare on Elm Street movie? Never seen it, so can't answer it. What about your worst Friday the 13th? I can't see it. I, I, I can't type. I can't answer because I haven't seen that either. In your opinion, what was the worst Halloween movie? Never seen Halloween. Do you think they were able to make a Michael Myers versus Jason movie? Who would you like to cast when the end fight? Mike, Jason or Michael Myers? I don't know. But I heard Michael Myers is better because he's never died. Do you think the cinema and the box office will le lose lots of money and business in the near future seeing as we can all watch movies online now? Maybe, and going to a theater is too expensive, you know. Over at over where I live, you have to pay seven something for a movie ticket, and we had to pay five dollars when it first came into business. In two thousand twelve, did you really think the world was going to end? Yes or no? No, I did not. But now they think the end of the world is two thousand thirteen. There's supposed to be a solar maximum. Every 11 years, the North Pole and the South Pole of the Sun flip and throw a burst of radiation here. And if it's powerful enough, it could knock out all of our electronics, even our drinking water. That would suck. And now they're saying that um, the water, like the ocean water and the river water, lake waters are going to turn red as human blood. How often do you go to the cinema? I want... About ten times last year, even with the uh, movies that I've already seen. Have you ever met any famous people in your life? If so, yes, and who? Well, I met this Isaac Batchlov. Uh, I can't pronounce his last name. He's a leader of a skincare group called Secret. Have you ever been to another country? Wait, no, I haven't met a lot of famous people. I mean, no, I haven't met anyone famous. Have you ever been to another country? Um, yeah, I went to Switzerland, and I want to go to France, though. Do you believe there's another universe apart from us on Earth? Yes, probably out there somewhere. <laughs> In your opinion, where do we come? Christianity or evolution? Eh, that's a good question. I don't know. Do you believe there's an afterlife? Yes or no? Yes, I do. Have you ever gotten a nightmare while watching a horror movie? As a kid. Well, I was 17 and I watched it. And that made me, I was yelling in my sleep, no, 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 don't get me, something like that. That's what my mom said. Do you really like, do you like Danny DeVito? I think he's all right. Do you think there will be a World War Three in the future? I hope not. Are you a fan of the TV show The Walking Dead? No. Never seen it. Are you going to see the evil, the evil, evil, evil dead remake? Maybe someday. If you can buy cinema stuff to take to own 
stuff with you? I don't know. To take your own stuff with you? Do you buy a cinema stuff or do you take your own stuff with you? Well, their Cokes are too expensive. My friend said he would stuff a Coke, in, an empty Coke bottle in his bag and take it with him. Yeah, but yeah, I do buy stuff to them. Are, do you play arcade games? Nah, I just buy play stuff here. Who are your favorite directors? I like David Yates, Chris Columbus. I like Peter Jackson and Gore Verbinski. Do you think Nolan's Batmans have been better than Michael Keaton got instead of Christian Bale? Well, I like them both, so I don't know. Were you a fan of Power Rangers as a kid? I'd only seen a few. Were you a fan of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles as a kid? One time I said, I'm going to go watch the Ninja Turtles, and they're like, not again. I watched them like a hundred times in one day or more. I watched them like more than ten times a day probably when I was here. When I was here as a kid. In your opinion, what are some movies that need an official DVD release? I don't know. What do you think The Dark Knight why do you think The Dark Knight was the most overrated movie of last year and why? Well, it didn't come out last year, my friend, but... Sorry for the inconvenience. didn't come out last year it came out like in 2010 didn't it or in 2009 or in 2008 one of those but I don't know why it was overrated I liked it are you a fan of WWE not really I've never watched it what are your thoughts on comedy movies today's generation do you think the worst are better than when you were in your childhood the hangover hilarious so I don't know what people are saying do you like Robin Williams as an actor? Yeah, he's freaking hilarious. Do you think Rob Zombie is the worst director ever? I don't know. Name your top 100 movies if you think you can do that. I can't do that, man. There's too many to name. What was the worst movie you've ever seen in your life? Aragon, Jack and Jill, and a bunch more. Home Alone 4. What's your favorite scary movie? Repeat questions, scream. In your opinion, what's better, Alien or Predator? Never seen them. Do you think you could remake a sequel to Freddy vs. Jason? I don't think so. I'm not that. I. Uh, in your opinion, what would... Would they ever remake the Harry Potter movies in the future? Maybe. Daniel Radcliffe wants to be James Potter in the remakes. Harry's dad. If you could remake the Twilight movies, what would you do to make them better? Who would you cast in the movies? Well, I've never seen any of the Twilight movies, and I would definitely make it into a, an awesome movie if I could. What's your thought on fanboys and trolls? They're just idiots who can't even say something to your face. Who would want to fight Arnold in a boxing Arnold or Sly in a boxing match? I don't know, dude. Arnold Schwarzenegger is pretty tough, though. If you could be in a body, buddy, cop movie, any actor, actress, your choice, who would you pick and why? Ah, that's a hard one, you know? If Woody Harrelson was a cop, I'd be his buddy because he's funny. Or maybe Arnold Schwarzenegger because he's buff. I'll be back. Hold up.
Sorry for the inconvenience. I was just telling my mom and sister that I can ask for no disturbances. Sorry. Do you like remakes or classics better? Maybe classics. Yeah. Are you a big Simpsons Family Guy fan? Yes. Do you think the Simpsons movie could have been better? Yes. Yes, what are your thoughts on the movie? It's not bad, but they could have done better. Do you think Rob Zombie's Halloween 3 will suck or be a success? I don't know, but I heard the second one was terrible, so I'm never going to watch it. Maybe. Maybe I will if it's good, but... What are your thoughts on the favorite Batmobile? I like the one that... That... Tim Burton did, and I like the one that... Christian Bale did. Who's your favorite Batman villain? Villain? Bane, and I like the Joker, and I like... Bane and the Joker. I like the... Bane they did and I like the Joker that what's his name did Heath Ledger who's your favorite superhero Batman who's your favorite death of the Halloween movies and why I don't know what's your favorite death out of all the Halloween movies and why don't know never watched them what's your favorite death of all the Nightmare and Elm Street movies and why I don't know what is your favorite death of all the Friday the 13th movies and why? I don't know. Are you a fan of Ghostface? Yes, I am. He's my favorite. Are you a big Daniel Radcliffe? Are you a fan of Daniel Radcliffe as an actor? If yes, all the Harry Potter movies? What would you say is his best or worst performance? I don't know. I've only seen him in Harry Potter and Tramma Paler or it was with Pierce Brosnan trailer of Panama or something. Let me see. <sighs> I've only seen Daniel Radcliffe in only the Harry Potter movies, but out of all of them, I've seen all eight Harry Potter movies, and I've seen the trailer of Panama, but he was only in there for about a minute or two. Have you ever seen the movie called... Maximum Overdrive, if so, what were your thoughts on the movie? Nope, never seen it. In your opinion, do you think Will Smith is overrated or an underrated actor? I like Will Smith. What do you like better, Sinister, Insidious, or the Panama Paranormal Activity movies? Never seen them. What's your top ten favorite actions of all time? Too hard to answer, but I'll give some actions I like. I like a lot of action movies. What are your top ten favorite comedy movies of all time? Okay, let's see. I like I like The New Guy, The Hangover, The Hangover 2. I like a lot. So it's kind of hard to get there. Do you like the Titanic? It's kind of overrated to me. Do you like the Hellraiser movies? Don't know what those are, but they sound cool. So I'll go take a look and see what it is. Do you like the Saw movies? I don't see any point in watching them. Do you like the Spider-Man movies? They're alright. Question number 100. Last question. If you were stuck on an island and you had one wish, and your wish was that you could pick 10 out of your friends from YouTube, who would you pick and why? Eric Verthar 92 because he's a really cool person to talk to, I would invite what's his name? I would invite Scooby-Doo 9608 I would invite you DJ, I would invite John Ferreira what pissed me off V10, that's his name um, Dustin Keckler Curtis 13 Urch Julian Nevels I would invite Nate Dunning. Jordan is silly, and I would definitely invite at least like Critic 75, probably. Maybe a few more if I could invite any more. But that's my QA video, so thank you for all your questions. Bye bye. Thank you for watching. Bye.